Welcome or welcome back to my channel, Nikki Styles Her Curves. I am Nikki, and today we are going to be doing a haul with some pieces which I received from Cider. If this is your first time watching my channel, I focus mainly on curvy girl fashion, lifestyle, beauty, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. So if that is your thing, then you definitely want to stay tuned because we have way more videos on the way. Also, if you like to see these pieces styled up on the day-to-day, -day, then you definitely want to follow me over on Instagram and TikTok. I post Get Ready With Me's, Outfit of the Days, Fashion Inspo, all of the things, so you definitely want to check me out over there. But over here on YouTube, we are definitely posting regularly, and I love that for us. We are glowing and growing. And I'm so appreciative of all of my new subscribers, everyone who leaves a comment, likes the video, all of the things. So let's go ahead and share what pieces did I get from Cider because they are good. I slid over just a little bit because we're gonna go ahead and try on all the pieces right over here. And let's get into the first item, which is actually kind of like a two-piece set, but it is sold separately. So it's going to be this tweed vest and then also the matching tweed pants. Now, of course, autumn and winter is here. It has arrived in full effect. It's already cold out here. And so tweed is definitely gonna be one of the trends for the season. It is a trend that never ends. It comes back literally every fall and winter season and I love it because it's timeless this is definitely timeless because it is in this beautiful black and white color and as you can see here it has some like silver detailing silver piping here and then it has these nice buttons I got this in a size 2x and then I also got the matching pants so I did also get the pants in a size 2X and the top and the bottom fit. Now, as far as the pants, it has this beautiful um, front pocket design here with a nice little button on it. Um, I will say that these pants, in my personal opinion, I think that they're more like gauchos than wide leg pants because I found them to be quite short and I am only about 5'4", five, 5'5", five, five, so I'm not a tall girly and I don't have long legs. So usually pants either fit me just right or they're a little bit long, but I found these to be a little bit short. So I'm not sure if they're supposed to be gauchos, um, but I was thinking about maybe taking the hem down so that they could be full length pants, but the hem is not that long. So I just want to put that out there because if you are taller, then it will still fit you, but just be mindful that it is going to be a little bit high rise. So you can wear them as gauchos, you can wear them as full length short pants, however you want to do, but they are definitely a very very good quality you could wear just the vest and the pants by themselves or of course you can always layer you could put a turtleneck underneath you could put a button up underneath but this piece definitely definitely is a great quality and it looks expensive and I love that I love when I can buy a piece that's affordable but it's definitely giving expensive you could also like put a nice little brooch on the vest and I think that that will definitely elevate the look as well. So this is one of my favorite pieces. I haven't gotten a chance to wear it yet, but I definitely wanted to just start off strong with one of my favorites. Let's get into the next items. So next up, we have one last tweed piece. And this is in like a creamy, I would say this is like a creamy off-white color. It has some black, white, and gold detailing around the neck. Um, around the sleeves and around the back. It also has a zipper in the back. Now, I did get this also in a size 2X. So I will say that on the tweed pieces, I kind of sized up. So I'm between a 1X and a 2X. I went ahead and just got a 2X to be safe because tweed is not a stretchy fabric. I'm glad that I did. I feel like if I got this in a 1X, it probably wouldn't have fit. But I definitely love skater dresses. I find that with skater dresses, it can be a bit shaky, especially if you have big hips big booty, then you feel like it's going to be rising up in the back, but I felt like this was a nice length that I could actually wear this with some like black tights and I could wear it to the office with a little blazer over it. Or of course, if I just wanted to wear it like out and about, I had that option. I did pair this with some knee high socks from Shop Cider. I don't have them in front of me, but unfortunately they were not knee high. They were not, they were not from the curve section. So I was hoping that they would be stretchy and that I would be able to pull them all the way up to my knees and get like, you know, that style. When you see the clip, then you know what I'm talking about. But unfortunately, they did not go up to my knees. They went up a little bit, maybe mid-calf, and they fall right back down and they just look like some little stocking socks. But it is what it is. As far as the dress, I love the dress. Would I recommend those stockings if you have wide calves? Absolutely not. So I'll link them just in case you're interested, but I would not suggest or recommend 
Ew. Okay, so the next item is going to be this beautiful pop of pink. This is a nice pink kind of like a sweater dress. It has some detailing around the wrist. It has this nice little fur here. And then also in the back, it is like a pretty open back with just this strap going across. And then there's also a split at the bottom and there is a feather hem at the bottom as well. So this dress I have already put on and I did take pictures. I didn't wear it like in real life but I did take um, some pictures in it so of course I will pop those pictures and I will also pop up a clip of me wearing the dress. I do plan on wearing this in real life as soon as an event comes up but I really really like this dress. One thing that I will say though is that this dress is kind of sheer. It's not sheer but if you are wearing the wrong undergarments, you will be able to see it. So you definitely just want to be mindful of that. Maybe you want to wear um, some shapewear that has like a low back and is either your skin tone or black or, you know, depending on what your, your skin tone is, you know what color shapewear to put on that's going to be undetectable. Um, so you just want to be mindful of that. And then also because it is a low back, you may not be able to wear just a regular bra. You may need to just put on some pasties or you may need to put on like some low back shapewear. But as far as the dress, it is really, really beautiful. I love this color. It's pink, but it's not like bubblegum pink. It's more, hmm, not hot pink. I don't know. Somewhere in the middle of that is what this dress is. And I feel like this is perfect for the fall because just because it's fall doesn't mean you need to wear black, white, nude, and gray. You can pull out some color. And I feel like this is the perfect pop of color for the fall. So next we're going to get into an outfit which I have already worn which is this right here. So we're going to start off with this skirt. So this skirt is kind of like a maxi skirt with a lettuce hem and it's like in a nice slinky material. It also has like a little bit of gathering right in the waist which I love because when you put this on it kind of just like kind of centers you and it brings your waistline in. I actually wore this while I was traveling in Arizona and I paired it with this corset top. So this is the top. I got it in a size 1X. It has like a stretchy back and it is kind of like a corset style bustier. I find that corsets with maxi skirts is like a 10 out of 10. I highly, highly recommend, especially if you have um, like an hourglass shape. The corset really brings in your waist. The maxi skirt really elongates your legs and kind of just like, accentuates your hips. So this is definitely one of my favorite looks. Um, I did wear this in, I want to say the end of August. So this is definitely giving fall vibes, of course, if it is chilly where you are. You can always layer it with like a green blazer or a cream blazer or if you wanted to pull out the pink in it then you could do that as well and I believe that these two pieces were from like the sale section so they were really affordable as well so the next piece I have not worn yet but I'm really excited to get to wear it is this dress it's in a navy blue color with some white piping I got this dress in a size 2x um the only thing is that it does not have pockets for some reason I thought oh wait 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 hold on does it Okay, it does have pockets, so disregard, it has pockets. It is like a cotton blend or like a nylon material. It's not denim, but it's definitely still cute. Of course, you can see it on the side. I would pair this with some white boots, um, just because I feel like, even white pumps, just to kind of like accentuate the white um, thread that's here in the design. And then also it has like a pretty high neck, so I would probably wear a statement necklace. Um, and then of course, if it is cold or chilly, or if you wanted to wear it to the office and you don't feel comfortable having your arms out, you could always put like a nice little white or cream cardigan over it or a blazer. Um, I feel like this would also look good with silver. So if you didn't want to wear the white pumps, um, I think silver pumps would look really good as well. But I really love this dress. I feel like it is perfect for um, um, someone who wants to look nice and feminine. Also, if you work in an office environment but you like to have fun with your wardrobe, then I think that this would definitely be a great piece to add to your wardrobe. And for the next item, this is my favorite, favorite item out of the entire haul. I do not have it with me right this second. And I will show you guys a video of what the dress looks like on. So this is a satin mini dress. And that sounds so basic, and I have so many satin dresses, but as a curvier woman, as a plus-size woman, if you have worn satin dresses before, then you will recognize 
that satin is not a very forgiving material. Also, satin on curvier bodies, it can definitely be very difficult to kind of like define your curves. However, this is kind of like a stretch satin material. And then they went ahead and they added a string in the back of the dress. So what that does is that allows you, once you put the dress on, then you just tie the string and it just like brings your waistline in and... It's like, I'm definitely going back and getting this dress in other colors. I got this dress in kind of, it's like an olive green, but it kind of gives brown color, which is perfect for the fall. But they also had it in black, navy, cream, and some other colors. And I'm definitely going back and getting the dress in other colors because it just fits my body so, so well. I feel like if you, even if you have like more of an apple shape, it could definitely fit you really good because it doesn't like cling to your stomach and your problem areas once you like tie it in the back it just brings your waistline in i can't even describe it but it is definitely my favorite piece out of the haul for me there's definitely some close seconds and thirds but that dress is definitely my favorite. and so the next piece is this top right here this is kind of like a crop top um i want to assume that i got this in a size oh this is in a size zero x um, and it is stretchy, but it has this 3D rosette on it, and I feel like the little rosettes are really on trend. They were on trend during the summer on, like, mesh pieces, but now I find them that they're still on trend, um, but in different ways. Like, the denim rosette, I really have been looking for a denim rosette skirt. In plus size, I have not been successful, but I did see a jumpsuit on Fashion Nova, but I don't want a jumpsuit. I want a skirt. Wish me luck. Now, this may be a little extra, but just to kind of go with the rosette theme, I also got this pin, which has a white rosette on it. Obviously, you can, like, kind of clip it to your hair, or you can also pin it to your clothes. So, if you have something that's a little bit basic and you want to amp it up, then you can just pin it right there. And then I also got some white rosette earrings. So, this is the skirt. It's a midi-length skirt. I want to say I got it in a size extra large. I'm not sure, though, so I'll have it in the description box. But again, it kind of has that cinching to the front and the middle. And I feel like that really just defines your waist and accentuate your curves. So I'm in love. Now, would I wear this skirt to work? No, because it's definitely extremely bodycon. And because of the coloring, I feel like it's going to kind of like blend in with my skin color. And I would not wear that for the office. But to go out and like grab some drinks or something like that, I think that this would definitely be really cute. The next piece is going to be a dress. And this is the dress. It's in kind of like a teal and blue, just like a watercolor um, color. I want to say that I got this in a size extra large. It came in both the curve section as well as the straight sizes. Um, so I can't remember which section I got it from, but I'll have that below. But I really love the dress because it has a mermaid hem. So again, that helps to kind of like define your hips and kind of flow out, which I find is a great silhouette for myself, for my body type. It does have um, adjustable straps. Now this, I would say, is not necessarily fall and winter, um, but of course you could always layer it with a shirt underneath. You could add maybe like a leather jacket over it or a denim jacket over it, or you can just save it for the spring or for vacation. I don't like to kind of like define my clothes. Like I get summer clothes in the winter, winter clothes in the summer. If I like it, I get it and I will find the time and purpose to wear it. Okay, so we are down to the last outfit and it is going to be this skirt, which has this beautiful print all over. It has like little flowers in like burgundy, navy blue, orange. Definitely all of the fall tones and colors. And then to go with it, I did get just like a basic halter top. So um, again, is halter tops really in season? No, but if you're going out, I feel like, you know, you're inside. And this top can be worn with so many things. It can be worn with jeans, the skirt, leggings, anything. So I got this in a size extra large and it's in a nice rib knit material it obviously goes right over your head and the buttons are not real but i feel like i will definitely get a use out of this basics or something that you can obviously wear over and over and over 
So those are all of the pieces which I got from ShopSider. If you're interested in any of the pieces or information on them, then you definitely want to go ahead and click on the description box. I will have the sizes as well as links. Also, make sure to leave me a comment. Let me know which item was your favorite. Also, please feel free to let me know what would you like to see here on the channel next. I have so many videos coming, but I always love your feedback and input so I can make sure that I am bringing things that you want to see. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.